Instana's Intelligent Remediation, IBM Cloud Pack for Data 5.0, and IBM's place in a Forrester Wave report. All on this episode of IBM Tech Now. First previewed at this year's Think event, we're excited to announce that Instana's Intelligent Remediation is now generally available. It's ready to assist DevOps and SRE teams with over 90 actions generated by WatsonX.ai for diagnosing and resolving incidents. Delivered as prescriptive manual steps, scripts, and Ansible action playbooks, these actions cover many technology areas, including containers, Elasticsearch, Host, JVM, Kafka, and Kubernetes. Previously, when Instana detected an incident, it would show automation policies and recommended actions related to the incident. It matched it with prior similar occurrences and showed how users resolved it by running an action and creating a policy. So until now, it was mainly prior work by DevOps and IT ops teams and their experiential knowledge that could help other application stakeholders. But what happens when there are no prior cases of an incident? Now with intelligent remediation, WatsonX.ai used the power of generative AI to help seed new solutions in the form of actions tailored to the context of the incident event. It helps diagnose the application problem, perform an action to fix, and suggest alternative steps if the issue persists. All in all, this is a really exciting next step in finding and resolving incidents much more quickly. To learn more about Instana Intelligent Remediation, check out the link in the description of this video. Next up, we're thrilled to announce IBM Cloud Pack for Data version 5.0, the newest release of the Cloud Native Insight platform that integrates the tools needed to collect, organize, and analyze data within a data fabric architecture. There are a bunch of new features in Cloud Pack for Data 5.0 to enhance your data strategy, including immersive experience, which facilitates the use of IBM AI and IBM Data Fabric platforms in tandem without the need for complex integrations or separate management systems. There's also remote data planes, so you can now run your workloads where your data resides with the ability to provision a single Cloud Pack for Data instance. There's Relationship Explorer, so you can use a knowledge graph database to present a visual map of relationships between data assets and governance artifacts. IBM's newest product, Data Product Hub, helps you break down data silos, streamline data sharing, and automate the delivery of data products to data consumers across the organization. And finally, there are IBM Knowledge Catalog cartridges that can boost the productivity of data practitioners by automatically assigning business context to enterprise data at scale. To learn more about IBM Cloud Pack for Data version 5.0, hit the link below. To wrap things up, IBM, with its flagship Granite models, was recently named a strong performer in the Forrester Wave report for AI foundation models for language. IBM Granite, of course, is IBM's flagship series of foundation models based on decoder-only transformer architecture. While most model providers focus solely on improving price performance, IBM prioritizes trust and clarity while still achieving suitable price performance. And it's working. According to Forrester, the Granite family of models provides enterprise users with some of the most robust and clear insights into the underlying trading data. IBM ranked number two in the report in current offerings thanks to its differentiated approach to models. And that comes with four major themes. Number one is open bringing best-in-class IBM and high-performing open models to our WatsonX Foundation Models Library. Number two is trusted, training models on trusted and governed data to bring Gen AI to business applications with confidence. Number three is targeted, designing models for the enterprise and optimizing them for specific business domains and use cases. And number four is empowering, providing clients with competitively priced model choices to build AI that best suits their unique business needs and risk profiles. To learn more and download the Forrester Wave report, hit the link below. Thanks so much for joining me today for this episode of IBM Tech Now. If you're interested in learning more about the topics I've covered, make sure you explore the links in the description of this video. And of course, please don't forget to subscribe to our channel, stay up to date on what's going on in tech now.